Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So from the title you should be able to tell what I'll be doing today. And also don't forget to check out the giveaway that I'm posting on my channel right now. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and start the video. Like right now, I'm using the Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade in the shade Ebony. And I'm just gonna use that to fill in my brows. And I'm just gonna fill in my brows like real light because you know i don't want it to take away from the eye look that i'll be doing i'm using my la girl pro concealer and this is in the shade fawn to clean up the edges of my brow to make sure that i have some precise lines now i'm going in with my next white shadow base and i'm just gonna Put that all over my lid just to make sure that the colors that i'll be putting on my lid they pop more after that i'm just gonna go ahead and go into my kylie burgundy palette and i'm gonna start things out with my transition shade which is the top brown shade in the first row and I'm just gonna blend that into my crease until I am satisfied with the way it is looking. Moving along, I'm gonna go into my colorful palette and I'm gonna use the navy blue shade right there and I'm gonna focus that shade on the outer corner of my eye mainly because you know I want that color to be more loud on the outer corner of my eye and then I'm going in and I'm blending out the shade and you'll notice that I changed brush just because you know I wanted it to blend out to the point where it's like graduating into the transition shade up top so that's what i'm doing right there and i also went back into the transition shade to kind of help to blend out the edge of it now i'm going into my next cream and this is a gold kind of cream and I'm gonna use that to carve out the area that I'll be adding some gold dust later on well not dust but you know some glitter gold glitter from Too Faced I'll be using the pure gold glitter and I'm just gonna place that right above not above right over the gold cream that I'm adding to my eye right now so that's the pure gold that I was talking about earlier and I'm just placing that over the gold cream that I just added to my eye after that i'm gonna go in and use some of the same blue shade that i used earlier to kind of blend the edges in so it doesn't look like i just have a straight line where both of the colors meet then i'm gonna go in with my next black liner and I'm gonna use that to create a wing on my eyelid
moving along I'm using my LA Girl Pro concealer and this is in the shade fawn and I'm gonna use that like on my under my eyes and like my forehead and so on the points that I want to bring forward on my face and then I'm going in and I'm blending that out and I'm using a damp beauty blender Now I'm going in with my Makeup Forever foundation stick and this is a darker shade. I'm just going to use that to chisel out my cheek hair. After I'm done doing that, I'm going to move on to my vintage pencil and I'm going to use it to line my waterline. Now I'm going to move ahead and I'm going to use the same blue shade that is on my eye, under my eye area. And I'm going to also use a lighter blue shimmer shade to go over it. Now I'm going to go ahead and set my face using my MAC Skin Finish Powder and this is in the shade Dark Deepest. Using my Sasha Buttercup Powder to set the areas that I concealed. I'm using my sweet plea, my sweet pea NYX blush to add some color to my cheek. Then I'm gonna go ahead and use my BH Cosmetics Spotlight palette, and from that palette, I'm gonna use the shade Radiance to highlight my cheek. And also, I'm gonna go ahead and use ColourPop. Do job luster dust to go over that. Right here, I'm using the color pop luster dust. I'm adding some of the same luster dust to light the inner portion of my eye. Now I'm using my Maybelline Big Shot Mascara to do my bottom lashes. Then I'm gonna go ahead and use my MAC Fix Plus Setting Spray to just spray my face and set it. I'm going in with two 
liquid lipstick swam color pop i'm gonna use the more chocolate brown one on the other corner of my lips and the more nudish one on the inner portion of my lip and that will basically be it for this video i hope you guys enjoy it. don't forget to subscribe thumbs up and leave a comment if you wish and i'll see you guys in my next video thank you for watching